Hi guys, so in my previous video, I showed you how to make this paperweight. But in today's video, I'll be showing you how to make a squishy. If you do not know what a squishy is, here are some examples. So there's this baseball, this muffin, this croissant, and for the homemade ones, this blush bun that I made, this smiley face bun, and this cookie that I have not decorated yet. So a squishy is just a fun little toy that you can play with and collect. So let's get started. The items you'll be needing are some sort of sponge, I got these round makeup sponges at Walmart for $2. Then I got these triangle makeup sponges at the Dollar Tree. And I got this brand new pack of paint sponges from the Salvation Army for less than 99 cents. Then you'll be needing some puffy paint or watercolors, but acrylic paint does not work for this craft. Paint brushes, and if you'd like to cut down your sponges, a scissors. All right, so I'm just gonna go ahead and open up my makeup sponges. So I'll show you what these ones look like. So here's what they look like, and um, so you can see they're like that and like you just rip them apart and then they look like this. So there's 28 of those. Now I'm just going to open up my round ones and there's 12 of these. So here's the round ones. And these ones are the same, you just Tear them apart like that. So there's 12 of these. Now I'm just going to open up these. So I'm just my scissors. So here these ones are. So that's how they are. So the shapes they have are a big square and a little square, a big star and a little star, a big heart and a small heart, and just a small circle. That's weird. <laughs> if you'd like, you can also use Sharpies. Today I'll be showing you how to make a cake slice using the Triangle Cosmetic Sponge. So what I'm going to do is put my cosmetic sponge on a paper plate and decorate it on this so that I don't get my platform dirty. Alright, so I have my puffy paint, and I'm going to leave this side, this side, and the bottom white because I am going to have it be vanilla cake and then put green for the frosting. So you can just squeeze some on. Like that. And then squeeze some onto the side. And then take a paintbrush and spread it around. After you have the green frosting done, you can begin to decorate it more with different colors. I'm going to use purple and do dots. I'm just going to tap that to get some at the bottom. And then it starts to spread out. So you can just do any design that you like. Once you get to the bigger end, I like to add some in the middle, like that. Then, you can just add some on the side. Now I'm going to add a red filling inside the cake. Just like that. 
Then you can just let it dry. I like to set it on a piece of wax paper so it's easy to peel off. I'll be back when it's dry. Waiting for it to dry. Okay, so it just finished drying. And now you have your own homemade cake slice squishy. I will be doing more tutorials on how to make different types of squishies in the future, so stay tuned. Thanks for watching. Bye.